Morning, Botai. Yesterday we started speaking about some of the halachot of brachot as we get closer to Tubishvat. Manana bet Yosef in Siman Reshvav quotes the opinion of the Rashbain Ba'ala Ma'or that if a, person's, a person made a bracha on a certain food, a certain fruit, whatever it is, and then later uh, more of that same food or food with the same bracha is brought before a person, even though he didn't, it wasn't on the table and he didn't have kavana, a person doesn't have to make another bracha. Because the way of food is, when you eat one food, it causes you to want to eat more of it, and therefore the halacha is that you would not make another bracha. Although it is subject to machloket rishonim, Kolbo says, if it was on the table, you didn't have kavana, you would make a new bracha. La halacha da'at maran is not that way. In Siman Rishvab, da'at maran of Shulchan Aruch is that, according to the letter of the law, even without kavana, if you have some of the same bracha, food, brought in front of you, you would not make another bracha. Now, this, the same applies if, let's say, it's a drink. Let's say a person was eating meat or fish or whatever it was, he made a she'akol, and then he wasn't thinking, and then somebody brought him a drink. La'alacha, he does not make a drink, he does make a bracha on the drink. However, in the Bet Yosef, he quotes the opinion of the Rashba. The Rashba writes that this only applies if he's brought a food with the same or lesser significance. For instance, let's say a person was eating, uh, he made a bracha on a date, and then afterwards he was brought an apple. That's less. So over there, you wouldn't have to make a bracha. But what happens if the food that he's brought is higher significance? Let's say it's the opposite. A person made a bracha on an apple, made a burepri ayat, wasn't thinking, wasn't on the table, then somebody brought him dates. Shiv'at minim. Da'at rashba, lefi, the Bet Yosef brings him down la'alacha, he says over there, you would have to make a new bracha. Why? Since it wasn't on the table, you didn't have kavana, and uh, it was brought in front of you afterwards, it's higher, higher significance, la'alacha, you would have to make a new bracha. The Menishchai rules like that, la'alacha, Maran Zuchon Bracha in Alichot Olam, also says that although it's subject to a machloket, if a person wants to rely on the opinion of the Benishchai, who paskins like the Sarashba and the Bet Yosef, la'alacha, it's okay, you would make a new bracha, unless you had specific kavana. A person sat down, he ate an apple, and he had kavana when he made Gore Priyayetz. says, anything that they bring me, dates, more significance, less significance, it doesn't matter. A person would be patur, and then according to everybody, would not make another beracha. Have a wonderful day.